Colorado Springs Walgreens break room. Joshua Johnson appeared in front of a judge this afternoon where he was also declared fit to stand trial for the second time. 11 News reporter Aaron Vitito is joining us live in the newsroom and Aaron Riley's mom spoke in court today. What did she say? Well, she gave the judge her opinion on bond being set for Johnson. Now, despite being charged with first degree murder, he is entitled to bond because of a decision made by the Colorado Supreme Court just last week. The ruling states that any case after July 1st of 2020 is entitled to bond. This is because of the state abolishing the death penalty in 2020. The court declared now there are no capital offenses in the state, which changes how bond of first degree murder charges are handled. Now, I just got a response from the 4th Judicial District Attorney spokesperson Howard Black, who says, quote, we are concerned about the legislative change. Our DDAs will continue to be deliberate in their request to the court on a case by case evaluation. Ultimately, the decision is with the court. In this case, Riley Whitelaw's mom, Courtney, spoke on the topic in court in front of the judge. She says she understands the need and the right for bond, but says in part, quote, there will never be an appropriate amount of bond that can be set because my daughter cannot be brought back. Johnson's bond was ultimately lowered to $10 million from $25 million cash only. He was also declared fit to stand trial again after his defense team requested a second competency evaluation. Today, there were no objections to the ruling and a trial date was set. Johnson is set to stand trial in September. We will, of course, be in the courtroom and we will bring you the latest. Live in the newsroom, Aaron Vitito, KKTV 11 News. Keep you updated every step of the way. Aaron, thank you. Fourth of July.